Hello and welcome to another video for Minus Touch Toys, Games and Collectibles. And today we're looking at the 2019 release by Funko from their Marvel 80 Years series of vinyl bobblehead figurines. Um, now this particular figurine is of Vulture um, and this is the box that it came in. So it says on the front of the box, Pop, Marvel 80 Years, it's number 594. It features an image of Vulture on the left hand side and on the bottom it says Vulture Bobblehead Figurine and at the very bottom it's got the warning information um, about choking hazards and so on. Um, and as you can see through the window um, there's Vulture and he's dressed in his green um, suit with wings. Um, yeah okay so but before we actually have a look at the figure itself I'm just going to turn the box around and have a look at what's printed on the back. Okay, so I've turned the box around, and on the back you can see it says Pop, Marvel 80 Years, number 594, uh, the image of Vulture on the left-hand side, and then you've got an, uh, got the image of the comic where it first made his, his appearance. So it says, first appearance in The Amazing Spider-Man, number two. Um, if I just bring that box closer to the camera, um, and you can see what the front of the comic looked like, I can't quite make out the year and date on it because it's very, very small. Um, but it says, at the bottom it says, collect them all, um, Marvel logo on the bottom left-hand side and the Funko lo logo on the bottom right-hand side. So, um, Vulture made his first appearance in the Amazing Spider-Man comic number two. Um, and there we are. Uh, oh, and before I open the box, let's just turn it to the side and there you can see you've got a very good view of the actual bobblehead so there's it says marvel pop the image of vulture and then 594 at the bottom okay without further ado then let's open the box take the figure out and have a good look at it okay so i've removed the figure from the box and you can see Vul uh, vulture is in this um plastic uh packaging um which is what holds him in place inside the box and keeps him in the correct place for it to be seen through the window. So I'm just going to take him out of the bubble. Um, there we go. And there he is on his own stand. Um, so um, the stand is actually attached into his back as you can see. Um, and there's a spring under his head which makes his head bobble. So you, there we go. So there is Vulture as the bobbling head figurine. Now, th these figurines obviously were not meant for, to be played with. They are display items only. Uh, but to give you an idea of the size, so the, um, the head measures about six centimeters across and about five centimeters deep. Uh, Vulture stand, oh yeah, the head measures about four centimeters tall as well. And Vulture stands, if you've measured from the bottom of the stand, to the top of the figure, you're looking at about 10, 10 and a half centimeters. Okay, so there we have Vulture. Now he's dressed in his green costume with the white collar and with the wings. And as I say, the stand is just attached to the back of his head. So you've got the impression that he's actually floating. Um, and the, the head just bobbles, just not the head, and it bobbles just like all bobble head figures. Um, that is it really, there's not a lot else we can say about these, these Funko figures, but as I say, they, they were, uh, weren't meant to be played with, they literally display items only. So, um, yeah, not meant to be played with at all. Now, these figures uh, were only released for a short amount of time uh, for the 80th anniversary. Um, and now, obviously, that was 2019. We're now four years on. They are no longer available, but they are. They have become very collectible. Um, Funko produce figures only for a short amount of time, and then move on to the next wave. So, um, the, e e pretty much all of them are limited editions, uh, which makes them highly collectible. And as, as a result, the prices go through the roof. But, um, but anyway, we at Midas Touch have managed to find quite a few of these figures, which are reasonably priced. Um, and you can find them on the Myers Touch website, which you can get to quite simply by clicking the link below, take you straight to the website where you'll be able to find this and many other Funko items and many other vintage toys, games, and collectibles come to that. There's over 10,000 products 
currently available on the website for you to view and purchase at your leisure. And also don't forget to hit the subscribe button because we're uploading videos for every new item that goes into the website. There will be something for everybody and I know you don't want to miss that because we've got literally thousands and thousands of new products which are being uploaded on a daily basis um, and videos are being shot also on a daily basis. So if you're looking for something special, you've been hunting for an item, uh, a rare item, a vintage item, you haven't been able to find it, stay tuned, keep watching, because you never know, it might be the next item to go up. Um, so that is it for this particular item. I hope you've enjoyed this short video and we will see you again soon.